this is the perfect Taco Tuesday meal. It was quick and easy to make. See how I make it. So I started by dicing up some chicken breast. It's going to be chicken tacos. So, and I'm making it crispy. So I'm cutting up these chicken breasts into small pieces, nice cubes. And then I'm going to wash this with some lemon and um, I will season it up. So I'm just washing it with the lemon real quick. I'm gonna drain that out. And now I'm going to prepare the seasoning for this. So I'm cutting up some cilantro, really nice and fine. Now I'm cutting up the half of an onion. Now I'm dicing up some jalapenos and now some tomatoes. So all of this is going to go into the chicken. You want to dice everything nice and medium dice. So now it's time to season up the chicken. I'm putting in some garlic powder, onion powder. I'm also going to put in some black pepper, some taco seasoning, and um, some ground chipotle. I'm also putting in some pink Himalayan salt. And I'm going to just mix this all up. So now I'm heating up my skillet and I'm going to put in some olive oil. You can use any type of oil for this. I'm just using olive oil, but you can use vegetable oil, avocado oil, whatever your favorite oil is. So once I put the oil in there, I'll let it heat up and then I'm going to start sauteing the onions and the peppers and the tomatoes. And then I will put the chicken in. So I sorted all of these up for about two to three minutes and then I added in the diced chicken. So I sorted the chicken until I didn't see any more pink in there. Chicken breast cooked pre pretty fast so this cooked probably in like eight to ten minutes. It was already cooked. So here's the cooked chicken. I'm just seasoning it up now. I tasted it. So you want to taste as you go. I put in taco seasoning, cumin. I put a little more of the chipotle, um, ground chipotle. And um, I'm putting in some cilantro. And, you know, you just want to taste this and make sure that it has everything in there. Once it tastes good and it tastes to your liking, it's all done. We're going to let it thicken up a little bit and then... That's it. So I'm making some black beans here. I just add some canned black beans. I'm just putting in some tomatoes and some cilantro. And um, I'm just putting in onion powder, some more taco seasoning. I'm going to put in some garlic powder and a little bit of the chipotle, the ground chipotle also. I'm going to just mix all of this up and let that dry down a little and that will be done. This black bean tastes so good. I also put a little tip of sugar in there also. The sugar just brings the taste, all the flavors together. So at this point, you just want to taste and adjust the salt as you do with the chicken also. You know. So now it's time for the fun part. I'm heating up my skillet again. I'm putting in some oil. Um, this is olive oil again. I'm putting in the oil just so that the tortilla won't stick in there. You can also use pan spray for this, but I, the oil does a better job. So I'm going to just put in the tortilla in there. And because as I said, I'm making a crunchy taco. So now I'm going to put some cheese, some grated cheese, and then I'm going to just add the chicken on top of that and um, just add a little cilantro for a little flavor. Um, I know the chicken have a lot of flavor, but I just like that fresh flavor that comes from the cilantro. So for this, you're pretty much just trying to melt the cheese 
and um, get it a little crunchy. So once it's toasted on both sides, we're going to remove it from the skillet and I'm going to repeat this process. I'm going to show you how I make another one. So I'm going to do the same thing, spread the oil, then I'm going to put the tortilla in there. I'm going to sprinkle some cheese and put the chicken on top of the cheese. And then I'm going to just sprinkle it with some cilantro. Some people put tomatoes on here also. If you're a tomato fan, you can also sprinkle some tomatoes on there. Just the freshness is so good. So once this is um, filled, you're going to flip it over like that. And get it a little toasted and crunchy on both sides. And that's it. So I'm going to plate this up and show you how this whole meal came together. I mean... This was really delicious. I really enjoyed a different version of the taco. Usually I just do the soft tacos, but I decided to do it this way and it was really good. I had this other restaurant and it really, really tastes good. So I have some sauce there that I made with some salsa and I mixed it with some sour cream. I also made the black beans and um, brown rice. And I have some lettuce there with some tomato. But I really, really enjoyed this meal. It was easy. It was fast. Nice Taco Tuesday meal. I really hope that you guys try this recipe. Please like, subscribe, and share this video. And always remember, my food is cooked with passion and served with love. So I'm cutting into it for you to see the inside. Here is the inside. I'm dipping it into that sauce. And I am just going to dig in this was so so good i can't stress how good this was the chicken is so flavorful the beans was flavorful i mean this is a must try so don't forget to like this video bye god bless So as you can see, it's the same process. I put the tortilla in there, put the cheese, then I'll put the chicken, the cilantro, fold it over, toast both sides, and it will be done. This was a really nice taco Tuesday meal. I really enjoyed it. It tasted really, 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 really delicious. Um, I'm going to show you how I plated this up. I actually did some rice and I did the black beans. I did brown rice and the black beans and I had some salsa. I mixed salsa with sour cream, which is a really nice sauce for this. And it tasted really good. I mean, restaurant style. I remember going to a Mexican restaurant and I got a plate that looked just like this. This is how my platter looks. So this is something that you can do at home. And it's restaurant style. So you see the black beans and the rice. And I just sprinkled all that cilantro on there for that freshness. I also had some lettuce and some, some tomato. And that's the mix there of the salsa and the sour cream. It's a must try. I really hope that you guys try this recipe. Please like, subscribe and share this video. And always remember my food is cooked with passion and served with love. So I'm going to cut into it and you'll be able to see what it looked like on the inside. 
So you see how it look on the inside and this was nice and crunchy and I'm dipping it there into the nice sauce. It tasted really good. The chicken was nice and flavorful and uh, yeah, it was a really good Taco Tuesday night. Okay, so you guys stay blessed. Bye.